Hey guys, me and Clone Trooper X39 doing another video here. This is another minifig cat order unboxing, and it was quite funny because I was doing some stuff for the Juggernauts and Master Chiefs, and I heard the doorbell ring, and I heard my parent um, talking to the guy. She had to, um, my mom had to sign a paper to get this because it came from a really um, overseas. So um, he said that um, you got something for your cat, and I don't have a cat. I have a dog. But he thought that minifig cat meant like a cat toy or something. But it's not. It's Lego parts. So let's open this up. This one came a lot faster than my other one. Like a lot faster. Uh, but yeah, like three times faster. So that's good. Okay. Got this opened up. Really big order. Huge order. Boom. Okay, so I got some waist things with a bunch of detail, the free mini stuff. Um, I got some gas masks, gas masks, claymores, and grenades. Gosh, so much stuff, I'm dropping it all. Um, I got a backpack for the minigun. I got some ammo chains in different colors for the miniguns. Um, I got some riot shields. Um, I'm going to make one for my juggernaut. I'm, it won't come with it, though, if you get buy one at BrickCon. Got another backpack. Another backpack, and then the minigun itself. Um, and then we got some tack vests. So let me um, clear a spot here, clear a spot here, then I can dump all these goodies out. So I'm just going to zoom in. Okay, let me grab some scissors and move the camera real quick. So give me a second. Okay, here we go. So let's start off with these tack vests. So there are the tack vests, nothing too special. Um, I got, let's see, I got, um, let me get this. Does it come with an order form? No, it does not, but I got two, four, I think I got three, six in dark tan, two in black. Let's move those up there. Let's open up the freebie. So, yeah, this kind of boring stuff. Um, open up the other side for those awesome belt pieces. So, I'll move this aside. Why is it? Sorry guys, but my camera is like tilting on its own. But yeah, so it's got like a buckle, some pouches and stuff on it. So you got three of those. Uh, let's open up these riot shields. Ooh, those are cool. Um, let's see how you do this. Yeah, here's some riot shields. I'm going to paint part of it black, like paint the perimeter black. So we got two of those in clear, and then I got three, I believe, three or four. Yeah, it looks like three, three in black. So I might paint the SWAT logo on those. Yeah, move this out of the way. Okay, um, next let's open up one of the mini uh, minigun backpacks. Um, so here's that. Let's see if I can figure out how you put it together. Uh, yeah, this is quite confusing because I've never had one of these. Oh, there we go. Okay, so that's what it looks like. So yeah, um, got two of those in black. And main attraction here is the minigun, so let me throw this together if I know how to. 
Oh, that spins really nice. So yeah, um, let's see here. I gotta put this piece on first. There we go. And there's the mini gun. Now I would get the tripod out, but that's in a whole Stanley case across the room, so I won't waste your time. But there's the mini gun. Let's open up some ammo chain for it, because you gotta have ammo to shoot down those. Um, zombies coming, right? Yeah, come on. Um, yeah, really flexible. It's like made of rubber. So yeah, really simple design. I didn't know what I was getting, so I I couldn't expect anything great. Um, I'm just thinking, how do you... Yeah, you just slide it in the minigun. See, it has a, um, slot. You can just... And if you want, you can attach to, like, see, I have a silver and a OD green. I'm pretty sure you can just attach these. I think that's what it's for. I don't know, but here are the colors I got. I got black, um, OD, and silver. I mean, they were like 80 cents, so I just picked up all, the, all some of the good colors. So there's that. Um, oh yeah, I also got a Uzi with suppressor. I've always seen their suppressors, and I um, and a lot of you guys would argue it's a silencer, but it's they're actually called suppressors. Um, but yeah, these work really nice. So here's the micro Uzi. Not micro, it's just an Uzi. I'm used to the GI brick one. So there it is, a lot more detailed than brick arms. I like these guns because they're more detailed than brick arms, but some of them are way too much detailed that it kind of stands out too much. And I mean, look at that. That even has like a folding stock into it. That's that's amazing. Yeah. So let's open up these gas masks and the claymores. Okay, so here we got the gas masks. Very nice. Got three of those in black. Let's open up these claymores. So yeah, very nice. Got four of those and I believe I got Yeah, I got two in OD green and two in black. Here's a look at the different colors I got. Yeah, so four in total. Okay, let's open up these awesome looking grenades. The reason I got these is because they were really cheap and they're a lot more detailed than brick arms. I mean, they even have a pin. So yeah, let's see, I got five in black and three in OD. I really like these, um, the stuff Minifig Cat does. I mean, it's just as expensive as brick arms, which is fine. More detailed. Some is too detailed, and brick arms is same price, but it still it still is good. And lastly, just got one one more backpack. So let's open that up. I think this is the one that um, Lego Boy um, used for his Snow Rex. Yeah, I think that's what he used. So, yeah. So, that's pretty much it, guys. So, thanks for watching. Please comment, subscribe, and see you guys later. Bye.